In this video, we're painting a purity seal on red armor, plus some other green vets. All right, we're gonna try something a little different with the purity seal because I normally do something that's very red, and this is red armor. The parchment won't matter though, so we're gonna do our leprous brown. I'm only gonna do one coat of this because there is a bit of a xenothal thing going on here, and I think it'll turn out well with one coat. All right, we're gonna do a highlight with bone white. We're gonna hit edges and raised portions and corners and such with this. Again, one coat I think will do it. This goes over well over that brown. If you're curious what a purity seal is and why this uh, space dude is wearing one, I'm going to do a blog post on my Tumblr. I'll put a link in the description. All right, we're gonna follow that up with a highlight of white. This is just gonna be on corners and the very peaks of the most raised areas. All right, we did all the highlighting first because I'm going to do the writing with my Micron pen. So, hobby camera. I'm just going to brace everything as sure as I can and just do some dots and scratches along here with this Micron pen. And then I'm going to let it dry for quite a while. All right, so we're gonna let that dry for a while and we're gonna work on the wax. I decided that we're gonna do a green scheme and we're gonna start with wog flesh. Now we're gonna do green because it is a complementary color to red, it means it's on the opposite of the color wheel. And since I'm doing, again, mostly red on the armor, having this little splash of green here will uh, stand out really well and it'll pop. I'm also gonna do this strap up here on the piece of casing on this grenade as green. And these two little spots of green, I think will look pretty good in this sea of red armor. All right, to highlight this piece on the grenade, I'm going to get some goblin green and I'm gonna make a glaze and I'm gonna glaze the highlight um, starting at the bottom up towards the top. I'm not gonna spend a lot of time doing this. While I'm waiting for the glaze to dry, I'm gonna go ahead and wash the purity seal now. So we're gonna do sepia shade on the parchment and green wash on the wax. And I'm going to try to keep this from pooling too much, but I do want it to hit, have some of it affecting the highest highlight of that white. So I'm gonna get a good layer on here. And then we're gonna put a dab in the uh, wax bit and that's gonna to put too much in there, but I'm gonna clean my brush and then use the tip of the brush to soak up some of that extra shade. So just making sure that the skull is showing, but there is some shade down in that darkened recess period. And now we're gonna keep glazing away on this grenade. Time for some green highlights. So we're going to do a uh, scarsnick green, maybe. We're just gonna hit the outer edges of the wax and then put a dot on the domey part of the skull and then i'm going to try to do an edge highlight on the grenade but i'm going to do that off camera because it's kind of tiny and i think i'd bang my head on a bunch of stuff if i try to get in there and do it and there we go purity seal on red armor and did the grenade uh, i like how the green is setting off against the red that's color theory for you. I really enjoy these little bits of detail that are on these Space Marines. A lot of fun. Take a break from doing large stuff like power armor or the leather pouches to do just a tiny little fun thing. That is how I've been hobbying lately. Please let me know how you've been hobbying lately down in the comments below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you'd like to get daily hobby videos, consider subscribing. If you want a preview of my next painting video, check out my Rumble. I do the occasional blog post related to the channel over on my Tumblr. And you can also follow me on Instagram.